Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to create any of the babies and make the baby to become the main avatar or any of the NPC for your Unreal Engine game project. So now I'm going to guide you step by step. First, you need to have the Unreal Engine. At the same time, you need to have the character creator tree. Once you open the character creator tree, this is the default avatar, but we are going to click the project here, click here, the character, then it is under the avatar human anatomy, you should be able to see a baby, you double click the baby and choose replace all and click ok, then wait for a while. Now. It finished loaded already. In this this baby, you can change all the skin color at here. You can just click here, go to the skin head, and here you can change the color. You just need to apply here. Let's say if you want to change change the skin color, this under here. You can adjust it. For example. Then you can just scroll up. Just now is the, the skin head. You scroll down, you can change the skin color here. Once you change already, you can copy this HTML code, right click copy, and you apply at the skin body as well here you paste it here control V okay next one is the arm change it here control V to paste the HTML color codes and also leg then change the skin color here control V to paste Next, what you are going to do, most probably you want to change the, the ice color. The ice color, you can just search it here, under the texture, under the ice. The cornea, the, the cornea L and F, you can right click, adjust the color, adjust the hue. Most probably not this. IR. Adjust the color. If you want to completely just to adjust the, the iris color, you can just export out, export out all of this texture and change the color. Next, you can give this baby a pant. You click here, give a pant here. Give him a pant. Next, you can this you can give this baby a shirt. Just to click here, double click, and finally, wait. You can see this is. The collision arrows, you can just click here, confirm, calculate the collisions, then everything will be fine. Next, it's your time to adjust the body shape. You can adjust it here, click here, the morph, under the full body, you can find some tints. The body, body tint, you can ad adjust how fat you want him to be, or you want a really fat baby. It's okay. Or you want him to just a little bit tint. It is up to you. This is the body tint. Alright. So the fat. The body tint. 
most probably I just want to adjust the, the body to let him thin a little bit or fat a little bit. Next one, you have to click here, send it to iClone, send the character to iClone. And here you need to wait for a while, it is loading the avatar into the iClone. Now you can see this baby is already in Unreal Engine. Sorry, this baby is already in iClone Seven. Just now transfer from Character Creator Three now to iClone Seven. Next, you have to open your Unreal Engine project. And next, make sure that in your Unreal Engine project you already have the iClone Unreal Live link. And you come back to your iClones, you also must make sure that your iClone and real life link is already installed at there. And both you open it together in your Unreal Engine 4.26. In your iClone 7, you have to click transfer file. Before that, you, have, you must make sure you untick everything from here. And then you go back to the scenes. Just now it's iClone and real life link. You back to the scenes. You check the name. The name is baby. I name it as baby01. Enter. Next, I back to the icon and real life links. Under the character, you only take the baby zero one, and then you click transfer file, and it is going to transfer to Unreal Engine four point twenty six. You already take it. You click transfer the file. Now you can see. The icon now it, it is transferring and you just need to wait wait in your Unreal Engine 4.26 after you finish it it will automatic finish transfer and appear at here so now you just need to wait first now it finish transfer and you and you can see that now it is under the content resolution contents baby01 folder if you double click this you can see that now this baby is already in your Unreal Engine 2.26 Alright now, we are going to make this baby to become the main avatar and also some of the NPCs Now I'm going to show you step by step how to do this First you must click content folder Go into the mannequin folder Double click the character Mesh You should be able to see the Unreal Engine 4 mannequin skeleton Double click it and Click Retarget Manager. The Select Rig here, you must choose Select Humanoid Rig. Next, you click Save and Close. Next step, click the Mannequin. Go into the Animation folder. Right click the Third Person Animation Blueprint. Retarget and Retarget. Next, you must choose the Baby 01. Where is it now? The baby 01 skeleton is here. Then you click retarget. Next. When you see the third person animation blueprint is appear at under the content folder. Click here and press F2. Next, rename it by adding an underscore. By adding it baby 01. This is important. And next. Double click the third person blueprint. Blueprints, you should be able to see a third person character. Right click it, duplicate, and you also need to rename it at behind, you put an underscore, and you name it as baby01. Sorry, this is baby02. I put the baby001. Okay, that is how, how I work. Wait. Now I, I better put it as 002 because previously I already have a baby. Wait, I back to here. I back to the content. This one third person animation blueprint, I put it as baby 02.
and then go to the third person blueprint under the blueprint the new character here I name it as baby02 now you double click it click the mesh click the viewport click the mesh click the viewport the skeleton mesh you choose as baby01 now I, I only have one next the animation class I choose third person animation blueprint baby02 now you can see this baby already have certain animation at there click compile and close now it's your time to change it to become the main avatar first you remove and delete the mana queen from the main main level press delete button to delete it now go to the edit project setting click the gameplay tab sorry click the maps and modes default pawn class is under the selected game mode default pawn class here you choose the third person character baby02 the baby01 is, is the baby last time so now, now it's the second one the baby02 close now when I try to play you can see now the main avatar already become the baby the baby02 alright we are we are also getting to make a make an NPC here. The third person character baby02. This is a baby01 last time. Alright. Now this is baby02 for today. Alright. I just want to put one this one. This is an NPC. So now if I play you can see I'm the main avatar I'm the baby zero, zero 002 avatar at, at the same time in, in this map in this level I can see another baby I can see another baby as well now the baby is very short I'm unable to jump up okay yes can this is a super baby you can jump you can run and now that's all for today about how to create any of the baby avatar for your Unreal Engine game project and by using the character creator tree. And then to make this baby to become your main avatar or any of the NPC in the game. And that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my video tutorial, if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful through 3D animations and game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all. So that when next time I publish a new video tutorial, you will receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy happy animations and game developing. See you.